Hi again, hello, let's play fans, it's your old pal Berg787 back with a brand new episode of Sid Meier Civilization. Um, five? No, what are we playing? Completely <laughs> lost my train of thought there. Anyway, we're playing Deity, we're playing Ethiopia. First uh, episode was a good one. We got a good location, river, mountains, and all that jazz. We got some salt, as I seem to always have salt in all my games. Um, obviously, I can't pick specifically to have salt, but um, it is quite nice that we do get them. Anyway, um, I think... Having read the comments and such, I think, yeah, Lake Victoria is probably going to be the best place to settle next. And I think it is going to be right on that tile there, which means I'll instantly, well, as soon as I get a worker down there, I'll be able to get those dyes hooked up so I can sort out my happiness. Because, obviously, uh, well, that's going to be hooked up fairly shortly, but if it wasn't hooked up, you know, I would be down to zero happiness, which, you know, we don't want. So, um, well, there is that barb camp over here. It could be a bit dangerous sending our settler off by himself, but he, he should be fine. Ain't miss last words. Should be fine. Now, you... Fuck off, man. Where was that ruin as well? I discovered a ruin somewhere. All right, there. Okay. Um, yeah, you piss off, man, because you're delaying me stealing another worker from Valletta. Which I need to do. Pronto. Oh, great. Uh, well, Korea are going to be a bit of a problem. Just because they're like super science. They're probably leader or well, they might not necessarily be leader already, but let's have a little look, see, just since I can. I well, know the Shoshone, but that's early doors, that'll change, you'll see. When we go to technologies discovered, uh, well, they are the leader there, joint them and the Shoshone two ahead of everyone else, so, hmm, where are they? Are they over here? I'm going to have to get people to, um, to fight them, So I think they might be a bit too far away for me to... Oh, well, maybe not. I get a city over here, but anyway, we'll deal with that in a bit. I'm a little bit disappointed, though. Should I? No, it'd be just a waste of energy for my man and a waste of good karma or whatever influence on Valletta because it's not as if they're gonna, not as if they're gonna become friends with me all of a sudden. All right. Oh, there's that worker from Yevren. Uh We do have that tile now, which is good. Again, another luxury. Also, something to help with production. Do -do -do. Next, next turn. Yeah, I think. See here. Well, there's a camp down there as well, actually, which I've forgotten about. You know what? Maybe I should send my uh, bowman or my archer rather, just down here to have a. Oh, oh, I didn't mean to move him, but it's not the end of the world. Okay, that's fine. Let's move him there. Just come out of that. Right. Okay. So what are we doing here? We're working. Are these the best tiles to be working? I suppose they are. Yeah, for sure. Alright, it seems to be okay. Yeah, that is the tile I was going to settle on, so good stuff. I always like it when the computer agrees with me. Now, I'm going to be really annoyed if there is someone there. There isn't, okay. Good times. Now, let's see. Oh, look at that, Korean settler. Just steal him! No, I don't want to declare war on him just yet. Especially considering I'm going to need to... Um, so I don't have a massive variety of luxury resources. See here, when I settle a city, city down here, I'll have two which I've already got. So that can both give me problems of happiness. And obviously I do get dyes, which is a different one. And I will hopefully get spices, because so I think I'm going to settle here. I think that will give me the bananas, the deer. I would get the spice, or the salt, but I wouldn't be able to work it. And maybe here? Because working salt is pretty good. Although that tile, I think I'm going to be working Vadis Ababa. I do want to be next to the mountain, obviously. For obvious reasons, you know, observatory and all that. Mm. Don't know. Because being on the coast as well, I could work that fish, which would kind of negate not having the bananas. But then that gives me less jungle tiles. Yeah, Alright, well, we'll just have to forget the salt, I suppose. We'll still have... A fair few other things. All right, no, no worries. Well, we'll let, we're not even settling over there yet, so maybe I should not dedicate so much time to talking about it. <laughs> right, uh, this is the worker. The worker can go there, build a quarry, and you might as well come over here and bash up that camp. Uh, you go one, two, whew, Jesus, one step closer, and I would have been. Furious, but that's the risky run of sending your settler un unescorted like that. Because I think also if you get a settler captured, it hasn't happened to me in a long time, but I, I, I feel like if you do get a settler captured, he then reverts to a worker. Like he's no longer a settler, basically. I know that happens when you capture an, 
an AI is settler, like he, he turns into a worker, he doesn't turn into a settler. I'm not sure if that happens with yourself. Maybe someone can enlighten me. As I said, it's been a long time since I've had it happen to my to me. Never had it happen on a game that I've recorded. Um, where we go? Oh yeah, we're sending him down here, aren't we? We'll do a little bit more exploring and pop up there. Uh, you found the city. Bang. Uh, yeah, straight away work that. That's going to be so monster, man, all that food. Which is really good because it means once we get some more population, I can devote all the rest of the tiles to production here, really. Um, it's even going to have two fish as well. This city's going to be monstrous in terms of size. Or size potential because fish, when you've got uh, like, uh, you know, li uh, libraries, lighthouses, and all that junk, you know, you really, I think you can get up to four or five uh, product food from them. So they really sort of feed me and salt and all that. Yeah, so it's going to be a pretty nice city down here. And the good thing is, as I said, fresh water here on these desert tiles, so they won't even go to waste. Little a few production issues. I suppose I do have a couple of hills, but they're all a little bit... Well, actually, one, two, three hills. So, yeah, a little bit a little bit down on the production, but... Uh, actually, hold on, one, two, three, four hills. Is that a hill? I think it's a hill. Is it going to show me while I'm in here? No, it's plains. Okay, well, never mind, whatever. Right, let's try get the shrine first. I don't need to necessarily get the shrine here. I wanted the shrine in my capital, but we don't need the shrine instantly here. Let's get working on those libraries. Because we do have the uh, the steel, steli, whatever it is, which has given us more faith anyway. Someone has built Stonehenge. When was it? On turn, turn 40. That's usually around the benchmark. I, in, in some of the playthroughs where I've practiced going through, when I've done sort of like a, uh, a sort of piety opener, uh, I've, I've sort of done... Well, it's a lie. I've done the opener for tradition, then gone into piety. And I've tried to build Stonehenge and usually I sort of have been using turn 40 as my benchmark if I feel I can get it done within turn 40 which can be done you need forests and shit like that to be able to chop and you need some decent production base uh, to be able to do that and maybe have two workers whilst you're so you know two quick workers that you've stolen usually I'd build a worker on that but you can do it can be done in sort of like early 30s in terms of turns but anyway that long story cut it short basically turn 40 was my sort of benchmark if I felt like I could do it before turn 40 I would usually attempt it on those starts that I was doing. Anyway, back to the game at hand. Archer bombarded... Well, they... No, no, we bombarded them. That's where I hit next turn. The mausoleum of Halley Carnassus, good for Pocatello. Our scout was attacked. Oh, right, yeah, by those archers over there. Another. I bet they're not going to produce another fucking worker for ages. It's going to be work boats that they're going to get out. Although I suppose they could have produced a worker and I've not noticed him and he's gone here. Let's just have a little look. No, he's not. All right. I didn't think they had, but but he might have done. You never know. Not out of the realms of possibility. You keep firing here. What are you doing? Just standing there, scouting my city out like, tonight we attack, but we're not going to attack. We'll stand there. Uh, I swear I keep hitting next turn and it tells me no, I haven't. Which is annoying me. <laughs> right, unmet player has entered classical era. Good for them. Yeah, because I want this scout to go and do some scouting, obviously, but he's got press more pressing issues at the moment. Pop there. Attack them. Wow, they really are just standing there. They're not really going to go anywhere. Okay, well, interesting for them. Right. Yeah, you might as well uh, work the mine now. There we go. Such so good having six food early doors. It just the name it frees up your citizens to do a lot of other useful stuff. Nothing going on there, so we'll keep waiting. We do have some more wheat, which is good. I always like wheat. We're going to actually go and improve that wheat next. So to in the nearby camp. What nearby camp are we talking about? Is it that nearby camp? If it is, that's pretty sweet. It is that nearby camp. Good, good thinking, Prague. I like the cut of your jib there and who you want me to attack, because I agree. Fighting these schmucks is the best idea. There we go. Thank you. Some free culture. Boom. Love it when a plan comes together. Uh, what are you doing? Oh, yeah. You're just sort of exploring. So where did they build that city? Jeonju. They built it here. That's their third city. Fez. All right. Well, they're going to have a little bit of a... This is a nightmare, actually, because they're in the jungles as well. Oh, man. Korea's going to have, like, some super science output. Hmm. I have to keep eye on them, but we are going to need to be bribing people, I think, at some stage to go and fight them. I suppose we'll have, the idea is to have a city here, so we should be able to fight them ourselves as well, but 
Um, I'm a self-confessed not the greatest general in the world. So, uh, what's going on here? Where did we expand to? Oh, I decided with this aunt Martin's copper. I was like, copper? Really? I don't remember having any copper. Be nice, more faith. But uh, yeah, I don't remember having it. Uh, what are we doing? Du, 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 du. Nothing. We're just going to go to continue. <laughs> I'm a little bit all over the place this morning, recording. I think it's these guys are putting me off. They're just not moving from there. I might have to go and vanquish them. Does anyone want me to get rid of that camp? Hmm. No one nearby that would possibly want it. Stupid. Well, I'll leave it there. I mean, I could go and actually have a look to see if there is anyone in there. I mean, for all, for all I know, it might have already been taken care of. That's why this guy's just hanging out there, but that'd be a bit weird. Uh, which way do we want to go? This way. Oh, the Celts. I'm not really big into tattoos, but if maybe she got rid of some of these facial tattoos, she wouldn't be too bad. I bet Boudica looked nothing like this in real life. Bet she was a dog. It's kind of hot like this, like with her red hair and kilt and all that. I think they're giving her a flattering appearance, let's put it that way. Uh, you. I'll give you barrage. You can come back over the river. Uh, two religions have been founded. We haven't actually founded our religion yet, have we? I would like to get one. Hmm. Alright, well... We'll, we'll get one if we get one. I mean, I think it would be a bit unlucky not to get one, considering... We're getting extra faith and all that jazz. Uh, let's keep heading north. <laughs> Fuck you! Why are these barbarians? Isn't these the same ones that attacked my archer earlier? I swear it's the same ones that attacked my archer earlier. Dickheads. I think my scout... I think they're... Oh, this is... A... Hurry up, Valletta, man. Build some more workers, you pricks. Alright, you're done here. Go on and hook up that. You can come back to the city. And next city. Wow, that's, that's really... That would be quite a forward setter, wouldn't it? That would give me two sources of, of sugar, but that is quite far. That is quite far. One, two, three, one, two, three. I mean, I could settle next to that mountain there, but then what does that give me in terms of luxuries? Diddly squat. Yeah, not a lot. Well, it would give me this sugar eventually. Don't know. Don't know. Well... We won't worry about that just yet, because we'll come down here and settle this city. Because that will give me an extra copy of salt when I eventually get... I'm going to have to start building a worker, actually, because this plan of stealing from Valletta is not really going quite well. Well, stealing more from Valletta, anyway. Meanwhile, we'll send you down here. Addis Ababa does have marble. Good times. I might actually have to delay that third, third settler. I didn't want to do that, but I need another worker. All right, we'll have to swap things around. We'll come back to you, settler. But even if we put a bit of work into you, it's fine. That'll be saved. All right, let's... We're pretty much working all the good tiles anyway. Well, that's not true. These would be... Uh, yeah, mm. Well, no, it's, it's true. This is better to work for the time being because it gives us more cash. That will change, though. <laughs> Uh, why aren't you building... Well, you are building a farm there, but I'd rather you build a farm on the one that's next to the river. That makes more sense. Uh, next. Except no, no, embassy. Okay. Alright, yeah, we can have an embassy now. I'm okay with that. As long as you're okay with it. Yeah, go on. Timok. Timok. Alright. These guys really aren't moving. They're just hanging out there forever. And ah, oh, there we go, finally. Um, I'll still build that set, that worker anyway. Yeah, I'll stick with three for the time being. Then I'll get the fourth. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I will get the fourth set the city out. Uh, but maybe after I've done a few things and seen where there's some iron, which is actually what I'm going to queue up next after I get uh, philosophy. Yeah, so 20 turns. You'll have all that jazz done. How much money do I have? I don't really have a lot of money, but in all fairness, production's not going to be too bad here anyway, as well as sustaining growth, because I've got two tiles with two food. So yeah, that's going to be all right. And add that, that's going to be two production, two production. Yeah, so I'll be able to get that library out fairly quickly over here as well. Over here, it's going to be a, a breeze. So I'm on course for getting everything done by turn 100. Did they attack me? I don't know if they did. Oh, the light with the bowmen that were up there were gone. 
is good. It's been replaced by hand axes. Should I end my war now with Valletta? Would it be worthwhile? Uh, I could steal another one. Um, no, I think I, th I think that's fine. Because by this stage, I'll be able to hard build another one when I do need one at a fairly quick pace. So we'll make peace. And that frees up my scout now to go and actually scout and see who else is out there in the world. Right, this is good as well. We Shall we get a bit of landed elite? Yeah, I think we will get a bit of landed elite help with that growth. There we go. Although saying that, taking the anti... The, the better... The, you know, the... Oh, fuck off! Sorry, my mouse is being a bit annoying. Um... Yeah, taking Monarchy, I think it is, might have been a decent idea, actually, as well, because we are going to drop a little bit down in terms of happiness. A little bit. But um, hopefully we'll alleviate that fairly quickly by getting that. There were people who wanted salt. They don't seem to want it anymore. Does anyone have a second source of luxury? Uh, no one does seem to have a second source of luxury, which... This is uh, a little bit annoying, because I'm going to need to buy some. Or at least trade for it or something like that. But hey ho, we'll, uh, we'll deal with happiness issues when we deal with them. In fact, shall we st I think I'm going to actually send you straight away down there. The quicker you get down here and start improving that, those dyes, the better for me. I know, yes, growing the capital, yeah, but they're going to have, have a dude there pretty quickly. Fairly quickly. Reasonably quickly. Whatever way you want to put it. Trespassing in Valletta. Fuck off. Yeah, I know I'm trespassing in Valletta. What are you going to do about it? I'll just go and steal their workers again. Uh, meanwhile, Scout. Oh, fuck off. All right, is, oh, shit. He's... That's a little bit dangerous, isn't it? Uh, you better scarp her out of here. My Scout could be in a little bit of bother. Well, it could be. He is going to be in a bit of bother. Now, where would be better to build... Here, actually. What am I even, why am I even debating that? It gives me these, these cattle as well. It would be nice to build even further to get more of the cattle and some of the salt, but... I mean, I could settle a city here. It wouldn't be too bad. It'd be super production. Food be alright. It wouldn't be a terrible idea, actually, to settle a city here. Hmm. One, two... Yeah be that bad. Uh, depends on where they settle. They'd probably settle something around here to steal that salt from me before I'd expand that way, but yeah, it wouldn't be the worst idea, because unfortunately this salt's never going to get into any of my borders to be able to sell. I don't know, I'll have to think about that. I still prefer settling one over here, especially because it will give me more link to be able to attack Korea, and that, let's face it, if, if they're left unchecked, they're going to um, destroy this game, so <laughs> we're going to um, have to do something about them at some stage, but We'll worry about that in a bit. Right, meanwhile. Oh, you attack me, yeah? Is that... Is that? Oh, no, it might not. Maybe they didn't attack me. Maybe I was wrong to accuse them of that. Oh, that camp is gone. So these guys have just been hanging out up there all this time. Well, it's, it's good for them, I suppose. Uh, yeah, we want to keep doing the way we're doing it. I want to get that fucking worker down here. In all fairness, I, well, I need to upgrade that because I need the happiness, but I would actually prefer to upgrade the salt first. But, um... Ayo, you know, needs must. Don't want to go unhappy. Our scout was attacked. Yeah, of course he was. I'm um, surprised he survived. Well, probably because these guys didn't actually come out and attack him. Attack the English scouts. English scouts cussed your mother. Said something about her being a whore and all these other kind of horrible things. That no son should hear about their mother. I might actually lose this guy. <laughs> well, no, I'll be alright because I can run him back. They ain't going to kill him this next time. Well, <laughs> I say they ain't. I'm pretty sure they ain't. Or aren't. If you want. Ah, uh, we'll do that next. Yeah, so things are chuggling along quite nicely here. Yeah, we'll have that library in no time in this city. Next. Would you be interested in a trade Yeah, I would be interested in a trade agreement, yes. Hmm. What's this? Go away. Shut up. Hold on. So you have free ivory now. Excellent. So I have people who would want to trade stuff. Okay, that's good. So actually, I don't need to hook up the, the, the dyes just yet. I can actually hook up some salt and then trade it for either wine or ivory. Does anyone want specific... No, no city-states that I've discovered yet anyway. We want one more than the other, but that's good to know. All right, you better run away. 
Ah, you come here. Why did you? Didn't I move you this? Oh, maybe it was going this way anyway. All right, there's a lot of action going on around here. Well, a lot of, lot of, lot of. That's where the meat grinder is. We seem to be thankfully a little bit away from it, which is, which is a good thing. But yeah, I'm going to hook up the salt first and then trade it. Basically, that's the plan for another luxury, because the salt is more beneficial to the city in general being improved than what the dyes are. It's just the dyes are needed for happiness reasons. Okay, we are going to be uh, momentarily on the brink. But we should sort that out fairly quickly. Yeah, we're all down to one. And as I said, we'll trade one of those salts. We'll hook up those dyes. That'll help us out. And then we actually can trade both of these salts, in all fairness. And we hook up this one as well. Which is what we'll do. That's the best tile to work. Yeah, you get the library out as well. So you'll get it out quicker than 38 turns. But let's say you did do it in 38 turns. That would push us to turn 90. Well, we'll get it out before then anyway. That's fine. We're all on. We're on. We're on target. We're on target. Everything's going good. Boudicca built the pyramids. Those pyramids in Wales. Or wherever the hell she lives. Somewhere like that. Um, yes, worker. Hook that up for me, please. Thank you. You come into the city. Have they moved now? Oh, they finally pissed off. Good. They were annoying me. You uh, come here. You might as well hook up that. Oh, you're there. But no, we'll hook up the ones on the river because they're going to be more beneficial to get them ones done quicker. How are we doing for time? We're doing pretty good. All right, Hanging Gardens built in a faraway land. A long time ago in a land far, far away. Someone built the Hanging Gardens. <laughs> Fucking Hanging Gardens. No one can even prove whether they existed or not. It's kind of like in this game. We've heard that the Hanging Gardens have been built, but we don't know who built it. I'm sort of far away land, and uh, we don't really know much about... Oh, hello. Yeah. You're friends with Korea. Well, I might as well be friends with you all for the time being, so yeah, why not? I'll be friends with Alf Garnet. Nuclear Alf Garnet. Religion founded. Shit, okay. Well, I need to get... I might not actually get a religion. That'd be quite bad. Well, in six turns... And then I need to be... Low. Wow, I, I would be a little bit disappointed. I mean, it's not as if I've based anything on religion necessarily, but... It is handy to have, like, your own religion. I suppose if I don't get it, it's not the end of the world, because I'll still be able to, you know, accumulate faith and by great engineers and, and the like that I want to do later on down the line. So it's not the end of the world, but I would certainly like it. And it would help in a culture victory as well if I could pass my own religion off as the world religion, because that does increase your, your tourism and stuff like that. So it is handy to have. It's not, it's not a game changer. I mean, not, it's not the end of the world if I don't get it, but I, I would be a little bit disappointed to say the least. Um, I will get that granary out first, then we'll get the library out. And, uh, you know what, haven't I, I've not actually got trade routes yet. I haven't even got animal husbandry. <laughs> right, okay. Well, we will get iron first, just to see where we've got that. And then we'll get some uh, animal husbandry, because I would like to get a trade route up. And then we're probably going to want to get the wheel. I don't want to delay things too much. I do want to kind of skip on. I might, should I go straight to education afterwards? Get early education. Because I don't think I need necessarily civil... F food wise we're doing okay and all cities will be fine. So far. So yeah, production's actually not too much of an issue. Although one city will have a bit of a bother. Mm. Well yeah, we'll do it that way and I will go for early education. I mean we'll go through civil service anyway to get it. But um, if need be, if I do need to change I can always jump out and go to construction or something like that. If I do, you know, if... if Something happens, and oh no, that's the social, and I thought, oh well, there goes my religion, but no, that was the same thing. Yes, you have noticed. Good times. I'm glad. You're a smart guy. Smart guy indeed. Oh, there they are. They're back. Right, let's keep trundling. And gold ended. What was he even giving me gold for? Probably like an embassy or some shit like that. Uh, yes, keep coming down here. You. So, I can't really go that way, can I? Because... Well, to be fair, I don't think there's much to see over there. And two, there's all those barbarians, so I suppose I've got to bring... I haven't really explored this southern part of the map, so it's not the worst idea in the world. Let's go that way. Five more turns. Well, it's five more turns until the chance of a profit. Again, that's not a guarantee. Hopefully, though. Hopefully. We want our own religion. I haven't decided what I'm going to call this religion yet, but I've got an idea. I've got an idea that people will like to spread. Um, Alright, Addis Ababa. Okay, so yeah, hurry up and hook up. How much more turns until that's done? Two more turns. And shit, that's exactly when you're going to... Um, 
Oh, well, we'll drop into negative happiness very quickly. But it's fine. We'll get out of that very quickly as well. Uh, copper. If we could get copper, that would be good. No city-state wants anything. We can't get copper. We can get ivory or wine, basically. But that's fine. All right. So, five. Keep things as they are like that. Yeah, that's all good. They are the best tiles. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah, just keep working that mine, man. In fact, if you could hurry it up, you know, don't want to push you or anything, because you are basically slaves, maybe do a bit quicker, and I won't whip your asses. Uh, yes, you hook up that salt as well. That gives me two food. Did it, will it actually remove production there? It won't remove production. It will just give me two food. I didn't see what it was doing there. Wait, hold on. Yeah, it gives me two food. Alright, so no extra production. That's a little bit... I suppose it's on grassland. That's probably why. A little bit annoying. Oh well. Still, it's a good food tile. For food, faith, money. Can't complain too much. I just wish it gave me the extra production as well. Uh, unit needs an order. Who? You. Who, me? Yes, you. Alright, come on. Let's try and beat these guys up eventually. Next turn. No, 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 uh, no, but I tell you what you will give me. The ivory. Yeah? That seems like a good deal, man. There we go. Wonderful. That helps us out. Helps us out a lot. Our warrior was attacked. Yeah, of course he was, because that barbarian... I can't believe, like, a barbarian is just standing there. Like, literally, usually they'll stand there if there's someone specific to attack, but, like, this guy's just literally not moved. He's like, ah, I'm just gonna... Wait, come on. Bring it, bro. I'll, wait, I'll be waiting. It's like, alright, man. You wait there. I'll fuck you up. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? Alright. Harare. Harar. Um, it's still worth working these... These more these production tile like it's better doing that than the food because I don't I do want the city to grow but I don't need it to grow massively quick uh, just to keep my happiness in check it's still growing at a reasonable rate and I'm getting production at quite a nice rate as well so we will do that granary would be nice but it's not imperative here that's for sure so we'll probably get the shrine afterwards yeah and we'll we'll maybe get the granary after that oh no I will want the granary though because I am going to want to send food back to Addis Ababa at some st well th but th not yet anyway we don't even have a fucking um, trade route so let's not think too far ahead right hook up these dies yeah we know about that next turn come on I want that religion I'm a religious man Berg the pious I'd love it if there was a Pope Berg be awesome Pope Berg the 778 no I can't even get my name right <laughs> Pope Berg the 787th. How would you even write that in Roman numerals? Compli Why am I moving there? Such a dumbass. Go there. Ah, uh, yeah, it'd be pretty complicated. Well, it wouldn't be that complicated if you know how to write Roman numerals, but I don't. Um, we just chop down the forest. No, let's not do that. Let's hook up the gold. Can you finish them off? Yeah, you can. Excellent. Okay, bye bye. No more smelly barbarian just hanging out on my doorstep. It was annoying the fuck out of me. We've grown to there. But I don't really care about that right now. 20 turns. I've not shaved off a lot of turns, but in all fairness, actually, I should be probably improving that tile. Because. How much more have you got to do here? One turn. Alright. Oh no, that's just chopping down the forest. Well, actually, by chopping down the forest, that will speed this up anyway. Because I'm. Sorting that out would actually get me more production. But it'd be fine. I'll be alright. Next. Doing for time, still okay. Uh, clearing a forest crew to 20. Yeah, oh, that didn't get uh, they, that. All it did took off a turn. That can't be right. Well, maybe two turns, I suppose. That's a bit rubbish. Well, you know what? You can fuck off improving that any further for the time being. Although, just go here because I want that extra production. There we go. You sort that out. Uh, you come back home. You keep exploring. Come on. We haven't discovered everyone, I don't think. Two, four, six, eight. Oh no, maybe we have. Alright, well there you go. We have discovered everyone. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Berg! Or your mum. Marrakesh, Rabat. Crabat. Ah, oh, look at that. I always move next to these fucking barbarian encampments. Like, come on, man. Give me a break. Give me a break. At least he can't kill my guy. I think. 
Uh, he might not even attack me, actually, because he is actually in a camp, so. He could do, though. They've been known to be arse wipes. No, he didn't attack me. All right, that barbarian's all right. I'll let him live. <laughs> yeah, like I could do anything about it anyway. But yeah, come on, man. Give me a religion. It's two turns past. When's my guy being born or whatever generated? Annoying me. Come on. Yeah, there we go. All right. We'll just finish up here. Uh, 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 yes, create me a religion. Who are we again? Ethiopia, right, okay. I'm going to take Eastern Orthodoxy. But um, it's not going to be called that. I saw this. Uh, I saw someone call their religion this following name on a thread on Reddit, and it did make me chuckle. I can't remember the thread, and if I knew the poster's name, I would quote him. I might see if I can find it again, and I'll, I'll mention him and give him credit. But the religion is going to be called... That Ass. Yeah, because... When a city-state comes to me and says, I want you to spread that ass, that sounds always good. And I'm, I'm really 12 years old and I like to chuckle at stuff like that. So there we go. We're going to have some that ass. We will take Tithe. And... Hmm. Hmm. Uh, I'll take that. There we go. Not massive, but compared to everything else. Was there anything better here? I don't think there was anything better. Not really. I mean, each world wonder, providing two faith. I do intend to get some world wonders, but again, uh, I do want more faith, because I said I want to accumulate it for great, ge for great generals, great engineers, but no, I think I'm going to stick with religious art. And we shall found it. There we go. So we founded that ass. Yeah, I do wish to found that ass. <laughs> So it's just going to make me giggle every time. Uh, you keep exploring. Addis Ababa has grown. Good. Uh, it is probably time for you to start working these mines. Yeah. And I should probably go and build a mine over there as well, now that you mention it. That's good. How are we doing over here? 15 turns. That takes me to what turn? 77. All right. If Even if you got this no quicker, but you will get it quicker, I'll be able to start the National College. I'll get the National College done quickly. It'll take me less than sort of 20 turns to do the National College for sure in Addis Ababa, but anyway, gone a little bit long, uh, just because of founding that arse and all that and explaining a few things, but that, um, I'm enjoying this so far. I think I've got a good base. Uh, as I said, that third city, uh, I do, uh, I know, I think it was Doxado mentioned to the right-hand side of the mountains. I agree um, to be a complete pain in the arse. Maybe you want to tell me what tile specifically? Um, I was kind of thinking this one, this, this hill, but you know, you could see. I mean, the hill does... One, two, three... Oh, right, the hill does give me the salt. Why did I think the hill didn't give me the salt before? Where was I thinking, then? Oh, well, obviously I wasn't thinking, but the hill does give me the salt. Okay. Yeah, well, maybe... Yeah, I think that tile, then, is the tile. It will give me the bananas. Again, providing that no one settles somewhere annoying. It will give me quite a few sheep. So yeah, okay, that is going to be the tile. That's going to be where the fourth city goes. But we'll uh, sell that hopefully in the next episode at some stage. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. And we shall see you tomorrow for the next one. Bye-bye.